Well, hello there. Um, I just want to kind of send out a little video, touch base with you, talk about the midterm exam. Um, I know usually in this class we proctor midterm and final, but since it's the summer, we just do the final because that's just two proctored exams so close together. You know, people have jobs, so it's just it's kind of hard to work all that out. So if you're concerned. Um, and you're used to proctoring midterm and final, that's why. Now, normally in my other classes, I just do the final exam as well. So I'm, I'm the rarity that only does one proctored exam. Um, so uh, regarding the midterm, you know, really what you should be doing is you should be preparing for this exam like you're preparing for the final exam because the final exam is proctored you're not going to be able to use your book your notes none of that so what I suggest doing is I suggest when you take this midterm exam don't use your book or notes and you're probably thinking oh but I want to make it A or a B it don't matter okay because if you fail the final it doesn't matter what your average is so you know, it doesn't really matter either if you make a A, B, C, or D in this class. Um, it does not affect your GPA, and you just need to pass it to be able to take your next course in line. So, you know, those are things to think about. Now, I'm not trying to discourage you from making an A or a B, but what I'm trying to say is do an extra to help ensure your A or B is not going to do you any good if you fail the final. So what you really should be doing is just all you can to get ready to be taking an exam without book or notes or anything else. Okay, even if you fail the midterm, odds are if you pass the final, you're still going to pass the class uh, provided you've done all your other work. So the most important exam at this point is the final. The midterm is important, but it's more important to prepare for this final. And so that's just my advice. You can do what you want to do. You're at home. You're on your own. Um, but I really suggest you just take the exam in the same type of atmosphere you would be taking the final. So just your calculator, scratch paper, pen and pencil, and that's it. Um, and then you'll kind of know, oh, I really know this stuff or I really don't know this stuff. And maybe that'll help really uh, prepare you for the final. Okay, so that's all I'm saying um, about that. That's just would be a strategy that I would recommend. Uh, I review exams. So, you know, if you make some mistakes, I'll get them. I go back and review everything you missed and I sign, you know, full or par partial credit depending upon the, the type of error you made. So no need to email me, you know, freaking out or anything. I'll take care of it. Um, if you are enjoying this class, you know, um, and your next class is Math 150, I do offer one at Lee's Town Campus. Um, so, you know, I would be more than happy to enroll you in that if you need help with enrolling. Or you can enroll yourself. I can send you the class number, but whatever. But I'm the only one teaching 150 at Lee's Town Campus. Um, it's this fall. It's a 930 class. Um, so, you know, that's something to look into. Um, also, if you, you know, are not successful in this class, you can still take the 150 at, at uh, BCTC. We offer a 96 supplemental instruction lab that goes with it. So it would be an extra hour twice a week. Um, so even if you don't get through 85, you can still sign up for the 150 with the supplemental. So again, it's just something to think about, you know, just in case things don't work out here or if you have to drop because maybe things got out of hand, okay, with a six week class. Um, I also, that's part of the class I do teach and we have other sections at the Newtown campus as well and Cooper, uh, probably Winchester, Lawrenceburg, all of them um, with the 96. I'm pretty sure we offer that at all campuses, but I'm not going to say 100% positive. But there's just some things to think about. Um, as you move towards the fall semester, um, maybe you've already signed up for the 150, but if you fail it, they'll kick you out. So, uh, you know, it's just something to think about. So anyway, um, I think that's all I have. 
you know, good luck to you. The midterm is due Monday. Most of y'all are doing a very good job at keeping pace. Um, you know, so you're, you're really uh, doing well. Some of you are, you know, procrastinating a little too much, and then everything's coming under the, under the gun. Uh, that's not a good way to be successful, trust me. It may do you all right for homework and quizzes, but it's going to hurt you, possibly possibly hurt you on the test. So um, so that's it. Um, again, if you've got any questions, email me, but there's a lot of information posted on there uh, about what to do for the final. i got links for proctoring sites, things like that. So please read the information I've provided to you. So have a good rest of the week. Take care.